Hey Princeton K. Okay, we are going to get ready to do our math lesson for today. So today's math lesson is going to be lesson 19. Today we are only doing one page. I know for a while we've been doing two pages, but today's only one page. So it looks like this. We see we have lesson 19 up here. There we go, lesson 19 and today's date. Because it's a new month, we're in the month of May now. We're starting with a five because May is the fifth month of the year. So we have 5-1-20, and this is what our worksheet's going to look like today. So we have a bunch of different shapes. We have some 10 frames, some hearts, some smiley faces. And I'm going to read the directions to you so that you can see what we're going to be doing today. So that's what our examples are going to be for the day. Okay, so it says, write the number you see. Now draw one more. Then write the new number, okay? So we're gonna write the number we see in the box, and then we're going to draw one more and write the new number. So that's what they did here. They drew what they had, they had 25, and then they drew one more and they made, what's one more than 25? Yeah, it's 26. So. That's what we're going to be doing today. So I'm gonna give you a few examples, all right? And then we're gonna go from there. So we're gonna look at this first one. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to see what I have. So I have a bunch of 10 frames here, right? I have quite a few, we'll put on this side. The sun's kinda of hitting, I'm sorry. So let's see how many 10 frames I have filled out. Cause I have some that are all filled out, but then I have one that's not completely filled out. So let's see what we have. We have one ten, two tens, three tens, four tens. What does four tens equal out to be, Princeton K? If I'm gonna write that number down, four tens, if you want, also Princeton K, before I get into this, you can have your T-chart if you want, if it's going to be helpful for you. So I might have mine here by my side, so I might write four tens, just so I can make sure that I remember that I have four. Or you can just write it on the side. I have four, okay? So four tens is 40, but we're not gonna write 40, right? No, we're not gonna write 40 because we're not done counting yet. So I have four tens, and now I need to count the rest. So I have 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, right? So I have 48. So I have four tens, and then I have eight ones. So I have four tens and eight ones. But what, the, um, what our worksheet says is we need to draw one more. Hold on, Prince K. I'm going to fix my things so that we don't have as much sun coming in because I don't want the sun to get in the way of our learning. Okay, so we have four tens and eight ones, okay? So now we need to do one more. We have 48. So I need to draw one more. So I just need to draw one more down here And if I'm going to draw one more, if instead of having 48, what do I have now? Do I still have four tens? Yeah, I still have four tens, so I can put four here. And if I want to use my T-chart, I can. I'll put four there. But do I have eight ones still? No, I don't. Let's count. 48, 1, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49. One more than 48 is 49. So 49 would be my new number. Okay, so I have, instead of 48, I have 49. Okay, so this is one example for what you're going to be doing today on our worksheet, okay? The other one, this is gonna be, this one's kind of a tricky one, this next one that we're doing, okay? But I'm really excited about this one because I think you, it's a little tricky, 
but I think you guys are going to rock it out, okay? So, here we go. What do we have? Yeah, we have three 10 francs. But you're like, Miss Faith, they're all filled out already. Yeah, I know. So let's count them, okay? Let's count them. We have one 10, two 10, three tens. What does three tens equal out to be? Yeah, 30. It's the number 30. So our number here is 30, right? If we were to put this on our T-chart, we would have what? We have three tens. And do we have any ones left over? Or is, is there another 10 frame that has any other ones on it? No. So that's how we get 30 because there are zero ones. So our number is 30. But for our worksheet, we have to draw one more. You actually have a problem like this on your worksheet where it has all of the 10 frames filled out. And now you need to draw another 10 frame or you can just draw one more dot. But I want you to practice drawing another 10 frame. Okay, so if I'm going to draw one more than 30, it's going to be 31. So I'm going to draw another 10 frame. So a 10 frame kind of looks like a rectangle, right? Not kind of, it is a rectangle. It has one line going across. It has one, two, three, four lines going down. And all I need to do is draw one more dot to make what number? We're making what? 10, 20, 30, 31. Yeah, 31. If we were looking at our T-chart, we now have what? We now have three tens. And how many ones? One, yeah. Three tens, one one. One more than 30 is 31. Awesome job, Prince. Okay, okay. I want you to go ahead and grab your worksheet. Remember, it's lesson 19. I'm grabbing mine and getting ready to go. Remember, it looks like this. And let's get started with our first one. Okay. So, here we go. Let's see what we got going. Okay, so just like what we didn't we're doing before, we have our 10 frames. Okay, so let's count our 10 frames. We have one, 10, two, 10, three tens. Again, if you want to use your 10, uh, your teacher, like we have here, you can do that. Okay, so we had one, 10, two, 10, three tens. So what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to put a three because I at least know that 10, 20, 30. It's going to be a number that is 30. So it's going to be 30 something. 30 and let's count 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37. So my number is 37. So now I need to draw one more, right? One more. So I'm going to draw another dot in my 10 frame. And what's one more than 37? Yeah, it's 38. So I'm going to write the number what? 38 in my other box. Okay. So that's what you're going to do for all of these other ones. Some of these other ones are a little tricky. Maybe for these ones right here, let's look at, hmm, let's look at this one right here. So for the ones that don't, that aren't 10 frames, I want you to make sure that when we have things like this, we circle 10, okay? So let's look at the hearts and let's count 10 and circle it so, so that we know that it's 10, okay? So let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. So those hearts right there are 10. So I have 10 and one. What's 10, one? The say 10 way, 10, one is 
11, right? So I'm just going to put my 11 because I'm going to let you figure out the rest of that one by yourself, okay? So, Princess Kate, I would love to see you finish the rest of this. Send me a picture so I can see your awesome completed work. You rocked this one out, Princess Kate. I am so proud of you, and I will see you in our next video. Bye, Princeton Kate.